All right. First and foremost, I want to start off by saying, Barakatha Yahawa, Barakatha Yahawa Shai, Barakatha Yahawa, Barakatha Yahawa Shai, Barakatha Yahawa, Barakatha Yahawa Shai, Call Hala Yahawa Ba Shem Yahawa Shai Ba Shem Raka Kradash. Double honors to the apostles of GMS, Great Millstone, who rule well and who taught me this truth. And uh, Shalom to you, sincere Akim, out there listening, learning, and pushing this truth. And uh, Shalom to the few sincere Akwath that are out there listening and learning as well. With that being said, I'm going to jump straight into this video. I don't want to write the za, it'll be edifying. As usual, I'm going to go into Raka Kwadash. And, um, man, beautiful times, beautiful times that we're living in. Yapa, Yapa, Yapa times. Beautiful times for the elect, horrific times for the two-thirds of Israel, the wicked, and the actual wicked Esau, Edom, and these other heathens that are confederate with them. All right, our redemption is nigh. So, um, this is a uh, part two to uh, <laughs> basically more getting on. Uh, what did I say the video was? What did I title it? Oh, the world is in a state of turmoil. You know, England, the UK is in a state of turmoil. You know, this place is through. Okay, something along. I forget what I titled it. But as you can see off of Al Jazeera, uh, it says latest updates, right? You see you got Flojo up on the screen, Boris Johnson, right? And remember, Boris Johnson originally resigned because he had a lot of uh, scandals going on behind him. So he had to resign, you know? And now a wave of, of, of prime ministers done resigned after him, you know? That's that's the uh, common theme now over in the UK. One prime minister is resigning after the other, Right? And they're having a hard time replacing them, actually putting somebody in the seat. You know, they got two people that are, uh, you could you could read it for yourself. I'm not going to read it. Um, but uh, basically, they got two uh, people that are running right now. I think the dude's name is uh, Rishi. I, I don't know if it's Sunk or Sanak. And you got another lady ne named, um, or I think it's a female, Keir Starmer, right? And basically, the parties are, they're, they're divided. They don't know. Who to pick? They're you know they're completely divided, you know. But uh, you see, uh, Flojo Boris Johnson was gonna run, and uh, he pulled out. Okay, so beautiful times, man. As you can see, it says latest updates: Boris Johnson pulls out of race for Conservative Party party leadership. All right, so beautiful times, man. Beautiful times that we're living in. Our redemption is truly not is truly nigh, and um. The brother you call mentioned this, and I, you know, I've heard it before, but you know, he's the one that put it um, at, the, at the forefront of my mind about the saying that that the, that the British had, right? It said the sun would never set on the British Empire, right? That was a saying that they used to have, right? And it says uh, the world's largest empire, the British Empire, spanned the globe. This led the saying that the sun never set on it, that the sun would never set on it. Since it was always daytime somewhere in the empire, right? You know, and uh, now <laughs> we at the feet of this man at, at that statue that uh, Nebuchadnezzar saw. Okay, we at the feet of it. All right. So this is uh, Daniel two and forty three. Uh, Slock it, Daniel two and forty. It says, uh, "At the fourth and the fourth kingdom shall be strong as iron." That fourth kingdom was talking about the Roman Empire, right? You see, so it says, for as much as iron breaketh in pieces and subdueth all things and as iron that breaketh all these shall it break in pieces and bruise. And whereas thou sawest the feet and toes, we're at the feet and toes of, the, of that statue though now. We're at the feet and toes of the rebirth of the Roman Empire, right? It's not iron no more. It's that iron mixed with miry clay at the feet of it, all right? The ten toes, right? We had the ten toes of it, baby. And like Elder Apostle Tahar said, it the, 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 that, that the ten toes really started uh, with the Brexit, okay? And you can see how things have progressed. My oh my has how things have progressed over there, okay? And um, we know the UK, but also the, the, Europe, the, the EU, right? Because the rebirth of the Roman Empire is, the, is known as the beast, right? Which is uh, comprised of NATO and the EU. NATO is the uh, military arm of the beast. And the EU is the financial arm, right? So those European countries, uh, along with U England, make up the, 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 the ten toes, right? You see, and they're divided, which I'm going to read. And uh, we know America is the whore that rides the beast, right? Okay? 
You see, so we're in beautiful times. We're at the end of the at, at the end of the prophecy that uh, Nebuchadnezzar saw that Daniel broke down to him, right? So it says, "And the fourth kingdom shall be strong as iron, for as much as iron break, breaketh in pieces and subdueth all things, right?" And that's why it said, "Uh." The, the sun would never set on the British Empire because it was strong at one point, right? But now it, it, it's, it's, it's not so. It's weak. You see, it's divided. It's, I'll read it. It says, And as iron, for as much as iron breaketh in pieces and subdueth all things, and as iron that breaketh all these, shall it break in pieces and bruise. And whereas thou sawest the feet and toes, we're at the feet and the toes, and remember, Yahawashai is that rock that's coming to bust this shit up right and whereas thou sawest the feet and toes part of potter's clay and part of iron the kingdom shall be divided and like elder apostle tahari likes to say that started with uh the brexit right you see the british exiting the eu right you see you see so it says but it says but there shall be in it the strength of iron for as much as thou sawest the iron mixed with miry clay right and as the and as the toes of the feet were part of iron and part of clay, so shall the kingdom be partly strong and partly broken. And you can see it's broken now, man. This bitch is broken. Okay? They're completely divided. And whereas thou sawest iron mixed with miry clay, they shall mingle themselves with the seed of men, but they shall not cleave one to another. Even as iron is not mixed with clay, because they're completely divided, divided over there in Europe, man. All right, starting with the UK, Germany, France, they're all, they're not on one accord. All right, you see, you see, we're at the end of this thing, baby. And in the days of these kings, right, shall the power of heaven, Yahweh Shai, set up a kingdom. That's the kingdom of Israel, Yasharala. All right, starting with our, uh, starting the, and the chief cornerstone is Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, okay? He's that rock that's coming to bust this bitch up. And in the days of these kings shall the power of heaven, Yahweh Shai, set up a kingdom which shall never be destroyed. Yeah, the kingdom shall not be left to other people. This, this world is about to be translated, man, you know? And the, and the kingdom shall not be left to other people, but it shall break in pieces and consume all these kingdoms. And it shall stand forever. That's our kingdom, baby. You see? You see? That's the point. This place is through. For as much as thou sawest that the stone was cut out of the mountain without, without hands, and that it break in pieces the iron, the brass, the clay, the silver, and the gold, all these heathens are going down, man. All right? And we know the head of that statue was the Babylonian Empire, started with Nebuchadnezzar. Then you had the Medio Persians. Then you had the Greeks. Then you had the Romans, and we at the at the very feet of it, the ten toes, man. All right, the rebirth of the Roman Empire, you know, and, and it's, it's it's fucking it's through. This place is through. Put a fork in it. Yahweh is coming to bust this shit up, and that's why this, the 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 UFOs, the the, the chariots of the Lord are, are, are showing themselves more and more because they bought this place is coming. It's through. It's it's done, baby. For as much as thou sawest that the stone was cut out of the mountain without hands, and that it break in pieces the iron, the brass, the clay, the silver, and the gold, the great power Yahweh hath made known the king made known to the king what shall come to pass hereafter. Okay. You salak had to blow my nose. So as you can see, man, beautiful times that we're living in, man. We at the feet of this, the, 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 like I said, the feet of the statue. And uh, that's that you could clearly see it, man. Okay, the world is in a turmoil. The UK is in a turmoil. The EU is in a turmoil. The European nations, okay, um, wars and rumors of wars. Babylon the Great. That's what we're waiting on, baby. <laughs> we're waiting on the sun to set on Babylon the Great. Okay, that's when all hell is gonna break loose, and that day's drawing nigh, man. Okay, the beautiful times that we're living in. You know, um, this is Mark three. You know, not trying to be long and super deep, you know, but uh, that that statue keeps coming to mind, especially when I when I think about what's going on. You can see what's going on over there in UK, man, in the UK, all right. And like the elder Apostle the Horace said, that started with Brexit, all right. And they're completely divided. They can't even figure out who they're gonna put as the as the prime minister, man. Okay, you see, you see, and the, the same thing is gonna happen right here in Babylon the Great. All right, we're coming into the elections, and we're gonna truly see how this place is divided, because that's the that's the sentiment of the world. 
All right, these nations are, are, are divided. The people are in the uproar. All right, you know, beautiful times, man. These are the times that all the prophets of old looked for, man. The apostles, they came and they asked our Lord, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, privily, what shall be the sign of thy coming, right? These are the signs, man. The earthquakes in diverse places, the wars, the rumors of wars, all right? You see? These are the times, these are the times, baby. Beautiful times. We're at the door of Jacob's trouble, all right? This devil is about to come down with great wrath, knowing that he has but a short time, all right? He's, gonna about, he's about to implement that MOTB, that Karagma, that digital U, that RFID microchip. The hour of temptation is drawn nigh. And once the de once this devil does that, right, guess what? Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is going to lift up a standard. Things are going to move quickly, okay? You're right. This devil is through, all right? All right, so this is Mark uh, 3 and um, uh, 23. And he called unto him and said unto them in parables, How can Satan cast out Satan? And if a kingdom be divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. And if a house be divided against itself, that house cannot stand. And if Satan rise up against himself and be divided, he cannot stand but hath an end. All right. And we're at the end of this man's kingdom. We're at the end of that statue. All right. All right. We're at the feet of it, baby. We're at the feet of that statue. All right. Again, let's let's read Daniel uh, a little bit. Read this again. Run through it. I got to read it again, man. So beautiful. Daniel chapter 2, verse 40. And the fourth kingdom shall be strong as iron. That was the Roman Empire. But now we at the, the, the last leg of the Roman Empire, the rebirth, Rome 2.0, all right, which is the beast, NATO and the EU, right? And uh, America is that whore that's riding this beast, right? All right, we in the rebirth of the Roman Empire. So it says, for as much as iron breaketh in pieces and subdueth all things, and as iron that breaketh all these, shall it break in pieces and bruise. And whereas thou sawest the feet and the toes, part of pot, part of potter's clay and part of iron, the kingdom shall be divided. And Yahweh Shai Hamashiach said, if a kingdom be divided, it has an end. We at the end of this bitch, baby. Esau is the end of the world. Jacob is the beginning of it that followeth. But in order to get to that kingdom, we're going to go through much tribulation. This devil ain't going to go out with a fight. All right, he's gonna he's gonna go back to his true colors. You're gonna see them horns. You're gonna see them teeth. All right, he's gonna come down with great wrath, knowing that he have but a short time. Revelation twelve and twelve. But there shall be in it of the strength of iron, for as much as thou sawest the iron mixed with miry clay, and as the toes, and as the toes of the feet were part of iron and part of clay, so the kingdom shall be partly strong. And partly broken, okay. And whereas thou sawest iron mixed with miry clay, they shall mingle themselves with the seed of men, but they shall not cleave one to another, even as iron is not mixed with clay. All right, they're they're completely divided, and that's the sentiment in the whole world. All these nations, all these kingdoms are divided. All right, even in mother so-called mother Russia, they're divided. All right, you see. But the course of the king's actions are going to stand, all right? Because the Lord has put his spirit in these kings, these leaders, to do what? Go to war. He's mustering the host of the battle, all right? He's, he, he's putting the spirit in these nations to go to war. He's gathering them as we speak into the valley of Yahweh Shepat. He's stirring things up. And ultimately, hey, as it says, uh, the, the real, the real, the real uh, star of the show is Babylon the Great, America. All right. All her allies are going to turn upon her and burn her with fire, in, including the UK. All right. Your mother shall be sore confounded of you. Even your mother's going to shoot missiles on you. That's the times that we're heading into, man. All right. Beautiful times. Our redemption is nigh. All right. Hey, so keep pushing. We're close. Shalom. Wa abad babal. Kwam nesharala.